What's going on, y'all? This your girl, Chandra, a.k.a. Curiously Beautiful, here with y'all with a new video. If you new here, go stay true here. Go ahead and hit that like and the subscribe button. And don't forget to tap that notification bell so you can be notified when I go live or drop a new video. So, y'all, got the fam with me. We out, having breakfast. Uh, this is our first Vlogmas. Is that right? Uh-huh. So every um every year, every Saturday in December, we go out have breakfast. So this is the first Saturday of the month, December the second. So we out uh getting some breakfast at Cracker Barrel. Cracker Barrel. So we're gonna take you guys with us. See you soon. What's up, y'all? So we finally got a seat. It was a little wait, but we found that able to sit down and get us a seat. But I'm gonna say it wasn't that long of a wait, but we made it to the train. But we have ordered our food, and now we're just ready to eat. <laughs> Yeah, y'all, so, like I said, this is our little annual thing that we do, and our first stop uh, this year, first Saturday of December, is to Cracker Barrel, 
I know a lot of people have mixed reviews about Cracker Barrel, but you know, to each his own. But Cracker Barrel do have good breakfast, in my opinion. They do have good breakfast. And, uh. Rate my picture one to ten. This ain't even a picture. If y'all, this is your first time watching these, my video, uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, tap the notification bell, so you can be notified when I drop more videos. And don't forget to comment y'all on anything I post, um, or just whatever, advice, or anything. Don't forget to comment below. Uh, well, you know what? Comment below if you, uh, if you like crap if you're a fan of Cracker Barrel, comment below. Like, is it their um, dinner and lunch that you like, or you prefer, or the breakfast? Because I prefer the breakfast uh, here in Cracker Barrel. So, comment below, let me know. So, we'll be back when the food comes out, y'all. So, what's up, y'all? So, we just at the table talking. And we're talking about New Year's resolutions. So I'm a, a fan of New Year's, New Year's resolutions because they tend to break the first of the year. Uh, don't even get started. Don't really be motivated. But and but normally I normally set them. So I said I wasn't gonna do it this year. I didn't do it last year. So. I was just asking, I was telling my baby what New Year's resolution, what it means and, and stuff like that. So, do you have any New Year's resolution? So, it's nothing that you want to accomplish, uh, that you didn't accomplish, did you get a chance to accomplish this year that you know for sure, even though we just first into the second day into the month of December, but you know December is the last month of the year. So is there anything that you think that you want to accomplish next year that you didn't get a chance to accomplish at the beginning of this year? What is it? So you think you want so next year your goal is to be better at school. Is that right? Huh? Anything else? Nothing else. Okay. Alright, so I'll ask the mom the same question. Hey, Mom. Uh, so, do you believe in uh, New Year's resolution? Not really. Not really. Have you ever made any? I have, but never stepped to them. Never stepped to them. So, what's the? It was. Have you ever been like a crazy New Year's resolution you made? Before? Not really. Not uh, really. So, what was the last one you made? <laughs> Way long. <laughs> Way long. <laughs> I think that's with a lot of people. Because I think mine, one of mine was to lose weight and feel great the next year. You know, I'm going to cut out this, I'm going to cut out that, I'm going to lose weight. And, you know. But like I said, we never stick with it. Y'all come in love. Y'all stick with y'all New Year's resolution. Or y'all just make them, just to be making them it sound good. Because I don't never stick to mine. Even if you would like to lose weight. Um... It could be something else, but I don't never stick with it. I don't know why. I don't know why I don't never stick. Do you think you, do you know why people don't never stick with they, uh, mom? You think why people? Do you know why people? Do you think you know why people don't stick with their New Year's resolution? Some people do. Some I don't know. Cause do you think because it's far fetched? I think people just they get the hype, you know, for the resolution. And, when you start, I don't know. It just, I can't just say. I can't say. Like, cause some people are, are start like, okay, my New Year's resolution. They won't do it at the end of the, like at the very end of the year. They'll start like, okay, in December it's December, so I know I need to do this next year. But then end of the year, like, well, I don't know why people. I don't know. I just have the extra willpower. The weird power. Yeah, it's weight loss oh. to have. It's the motivation to have. And some people just don't have that motivation. Work. And if they do it by themselves, you know it's hard to do it by yourself. But you have like yeah. people to motivate you, you probably can succeed on your own. You know, yeah. that, 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 that's the issue. Yeah. Yeah, it is, uh, though. You got to have a willpower. And, you know, some people might say it's a mind thing. Is it? I don't know. 
know. But I'm not making New Year's resolution. I'm just gonna go with the flow. I'm gonna go with the flow. But I know it's some things that I need to change, but I'm not gonna make it a New Year's resolution. I know I'm not gonna do that. I'm gonna just start. But what I say I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start writing, either taking notes, or either get a journal, and just start writing. Uh, every day, I know I'm gonna start doing it, and uh, I know I've already started starting, but but what I'm writing is just things that that has been just going on just right right now, but nothing that I want to accomplish or any goals, anything. So you know, but uh, also drop another comment below, do y'all. Ladies, do y'all have journals? Do y'all write in journals? She do. She do. Because, like I said, this, I think that's a good thing for people to do start writing in journals. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. Okay. I'm trying to get out of this cold, cold, whatever it is. I'm trying to get over it. Sick of it. But, uh, yeah. Yeah, let us know. Oh, about the rest of New Year's resolution. I'm hungry. You hungry? I'm hungry, man. I'm hungry. So you ate some toast and strudels. We haven't ate anything this morning. I'm hungry. And this Sprite just not done. I need to really stop drinking. I know, I know one thing I'm going to do. We say we'll start drinking more water. Yeah. You got to drink more water. I mean, I drink water. Like, I'm at work. That's all I drink is water. If I'm not drinking coffee or tea, like when I've been made it at home, and I drink it at work. And if I haven't drunk it up all the way, like, sometimes I be so busy, I don't get a chance to go get up and go, you know, get some water or whatever. I wait some break. But sometimes my tea... It'll last me all day, and the cup that I have, it stay warm all day. I buy the same hot thing I Okay, so you know, but the tea is good for you as well, because I drink the uh, probiotic tea, so it's pretty good for you. But uh, but I know for sure my water intake is going to increase for sure. It's going to increase. All right, y'all, we're gonna wait till our food comes out. I hit y'all, cause I'm too hungry. Like, we want food. We want food. Now we gonna do it. We gonna, we gonna do it. Thank you. Okay, so I have biscuits came out and my mama's family came out. So we still gonna wait a couple of hours. Three biscuits. I like biscuits. I don't like biscuits. It's hard. I don't like biscuits. It's hard. 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 Yeah, we could. I'm talking about the bottom of the house. Just put it from the basement and everything up. So how we putting the one in the front too, or just the one in the front? We had two pieces. Mm-hmm. I don't remember. I don't remember that one. It was. Yeah, we had time to use to put it up every year. It was easy to put the big one up in the front. It's like about the size of the tree action. And then we had one in the front. I don't remember the one in the front. I remember the one in the Pour the water. 
been grabbing the table down and it's in the front. These are one of the different ones we'll go ahead and put up cars. You can try to go over and jump on the front of the lane. Get in the Christmas spirit. And put mine on my truck. Uh -huh. Oh, we still have that. You probably have to buy you, buy you one. Like the tabletop and put the tree. You put your own uh, decorations on. And I don't think, unless it's still, uh, uh, if it's up there in the air. So this year, we want to do something different for Christmas. So we want to do like some seafood. You know, like, we had to do seafood this year. Chili for Christmas, but I'll get it. And 
Alright y'all, so we done with breakfast slash lunch. Okay, so as y'all saw, I got breakfast. She got breakfast. Oh. She got oh, mama. <laughs> she got lunch. <laughs> so y'all, she got y'all. I show her 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 meal. She got the fried fish, macaroni, hush puppies, and a salad. The fish, how was the fish? No season, no nothing. She said the fish was bland. Like they just got it out the water. Threw some batter on in there. Fried yeah. it. <laughs> the fish was bland. No season on it. So I told the waiter. When they went to the restaurant. That, you know she didn't care for what she ain't like. She's like what else? What else can she? I'm like I don't know what else she want. You know. Um, so she came back to the table. When they came back. And so she was like. No, I don't really don't want nothing. No, she was like, but I don't want you to not like it or uh, not want something else. So, ooh. hold on, my bad, y'all. So, I don't want y'all to not like it or whatever the case might be. So, she ended up saying, "What you think uh, about <coughs> the um?" She said, what about the meatloaf? You have you had the meatloaf? She asked the waiter, have you had the meatloaf before? She was like, well, I haven't, but my mom likes it. She order it all the time. She said, okay, bring me the meatloaf. <laughs> she brought her the meatloaf, y'all. Hold on. I'm going to show you how the meatloaf look. Meatloaf look. But the meatloaf yeah. was, she just brought it out on a plate. Just the hunk of meat. Damn. This like, can y'all see? It ain't blurred. It's just the hunk, the, the the last end of the loaf. She just brought it out and oh, just served it up. And how was the meatloaf? <coughs> what do you? It's smelling. How was the meatloaf? Worse than this. <laughs> <laughs> the meatloaf worse than the fish, y'all. Then why I told her she should have got breakfast. Can't go wrong with breakfast. You got some pancakes, right? some eggs, and bacon like we did. So y'all, like I said, this is our little annual thing that we do. Coming out for breakfast next Saturday. I'm not sure where we're gonna go, <laughs> but it's gonna be somewhere else. Um, hopefully the food is better. Um, it's somewhere we ain't never been before. We'll try to go somewhere we ain't never been before. <coughs> uh, but yeah. So, we leaving here. We might take y'all. Where, where we going next, y'all? Five Below. You gotta get something for Five Below. We got to get my... Mom, you got anywhere to go do today? Nowhere but the compound. Okay. We going to the compound. Yeah, the All compound. Right. The compound the is compound. my grandma's house, and, which is our family home. And we just gather over there family gatherings and everything so 
we gonna go over there and uh, put up the tree, the Christmas tree today. And I'll take you guys with me no. along the way. All right, y'all. All right, y'all, we have to come to Five Below. Because <laughs> I want to give my cousin, my cousins, for Christmas, so I'm gonna get them something. I'm gonna get them something. Right. Let's see. 